you're reading a book, Montlu. Oh, yeah? You know I'm going to school tomorrow. Do you think I could be an astronaut by nighttime? You want to be an astronaut by tomorrow night? You've just started going to school. Well, I think I can even be an architect by noon if I study a lot. Even a space architect! <laughs> I think you can even be a space architect by tomorrow morning. But you should get some rest first, my boy. But, Daddy, listen! I simply can't decide what I'll be in school tomorrow. Should I be an astronaut or a space architect? I think I want to be a fireman, too! Is someone losing their sleep over something? Hi, Mom! Do you think there's fire in outer space? I surely hope there's not. But it's time to sleep now. Okay. Well, good night. Good, good night, night, son. son. It sure seems so. He insisted that he'd get into third year classes, but right now, he told his teacher that he'd finish school so fast and open a restaurant in outer space. Huh. Ha, speak of the devil. What's that in your hand, Mutlu? I think that is a turtle. We're gonna spend a couple of days together, little turtle. I'll tell you some stories, and we'll play some games, and we can even dance if you would like. I want to introduce you to some people. They always get home from school before I do. Where are they? What did Mutlu discover? A little turtle. Come on, let's go take a look. We'll have so much fun, so much. Welcome home, you guys. Who is Mutlu talking to? With his brand new turtle friend. <laughs> a brand new turtle friend. That's a sight to see. Who do I hear has a new friend? Mutlu. I think it would be nice if we welcome our new guests. Of course, of course. Now you stay here, little turtle. I'll find a safe place for you to stay. And then I'll introduce you to people from all over. Uh, do you see this, little turtle? Everyone is here. <laughs> welcome our little turtle guest. Where did you find this little friend, Muntlu? This little turtle is under my supervision for the weekend. Our teacher wanted me to take care of him, feed him, and protect him like a hero. I'll take him back to school on Monday, and I get to tell my class all the adventures we've had. Ha ha ha! Super Muttlu is on the case. I'm sure that you'll take good care of your friend. We need to make our guest more comfortable, right? He is so cute. Don't bother if you're looking for a place for him, Muttlu, because his house is already on his back. So he gets to wander around with his house? <gasps> what do turtles eat on their planet? Wait! I know this! They eat green stuff. I need to find a tasty green leaf for him right away. It looks like another adventurous weekend for you. <laughs> <laughs> I think so, too. Come on, let's cook dinner. Got it! I found food appropriate for him. Let him eat this first. I'll teach him to dance later. What did you do, Mutlu? How can a little turtle eat this huge leaf all by itself? But it'll grow more quickly if he eats this, sis. He needs to be much larger by the time Monday comes around. No way, Mutlu. I think his stomach must be so tiny now. You know, I think this is too much. Let me tell my teacher that he needs to stay longer. He'll finish it by then. Today I found a new friend, it's a turtle. He's a bit slow, but don't mind him. He still gets around fine. He walks around the grass all day, walks around the yard. Takes a nap if he's tired, having his house on his back. Oh, my turtle. Walks around the grass all day, walks around the yard. Oh, oh my turtle. Wherever he goes, he's got his house on his back. Oh, We'll start from here, turn from there, around the house, pass from here, turn twice around this tree, and come to the final point. The first one to get there wins the race. I think this should be awesome. One, two, and three, begin! We go around this thing, then right here. Ooh, you're so slow, turtle. 
Hmm, let's have a little nap. I can rest right here. See you at the finish line. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Mr. Kanan, Mr. Kanan, I brought you your order. These are for your son, Mutt Lou. Thank you, Mr. Gross. Hey, Mutt Lou, your order has arrived. Mutt Lou! <laughs> it seems that the little turtle tired out Mutt Lou so fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh, did you really buy a turtle for Mutt Lou? No, Mr. Remy. His teacher gave Mutt Lou a little responsibility, huh? Did you see how I beat the little turtle by a long shot? Little turtle, where are you? What happened, Mutt Lou? Did you lose the little turtle? Yeah, 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 yeah. He's around here, kiddo. The little turtle is lost. I'm telling you that he got lost. Haven't you seen him? What if something happened to uh, him? Uh, 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 yeah, yeah, I didn't uh, see him, Mutt Lou. Turtles are very slow. He couldn't have gone that far at all. Take it easy, Mutt Lou. Come and we'll look for him together. Let me look over here, and you look around the house, all right? Yeah, yeah, this is a turtle. Where could he go? We will help you find him, so don't worry. Now tell it to me calmly, Mutlu. Where did you last see the little turtle? We were racing on this path that I drew. He was so slow. I wanted to take a nap because I definitely win, but he was gone when I woke up. According to this, the turtle could be anywhere around the house and the garden. What can we do? Let's go and find him. Okay, Dad is looking around the front door right now. We could... Mm. Uh, yes, we should look everywhere. Where are you, little turtle? Little turtle, where are you? Oh. Mm. He's not here. He's not here. He's not here either. He's not here. He's not over here. Where on earth did he go? Oh, my little turtle friend. He's not here. We looked everywhere, but we couldn't find him. What is this, Mutlu? Just a tale about a turtle and a rabbit who entered a race together. I ran into Little Turtle yesterday. The turtle won the race when the rabbit became too confident he'd win himself, so he didn't race well. Aha! I know now. Ha! You're here, just as I guessed you would be. You won the race just like the turtle in the fairy tale. <laughs> oh, my dear rabbit son. The little one was slow but determined. <laughs> Actually, this doesn't count. I think it's time for a rematch. Mutt Lou! Okay, okay, it was a joke. That's how it went! And now my turtle friend and I have a show for all of you. What is wrong, Neshi? You look sad. I know, I am a bit sad. Because of the new member of your family? How do you know about that? Mutlu told me. We struggled so hard to make peace with the shop -a -lots. Goochlu and I even made it to the world's core. There's gonna be a solution for sure. All our plans failed though. Minnie and Manny and Goochlu, they didn't tell me anything, but I'm sure that they're mad at me. Mad at you? Why would they be mad at you? You didn't break the deal, did you? Yes, I know, but shop -a -lot Baby is in my house. I don't think that Goochlu or Manny and Minnie are really mad at you. How do you know that, Omer? You don't even know any of them. You are mistaken. I do know them well. How is that? <laughs> Goochlu, but this stays between you and me. Oh, this is too much to take in. Oh, oh, sweet thing. You'll be fine now. Oh, maybe I should try. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, sweet baby. Oh, oh, let me have a try. She's smiling. All right, all right. Let me have a try. Little Shabalot, you tiny Shabalot. What are you doing on Earth? How did you come all the way here? And like that's not enough, why do 
you cry all oh, the time? She's asleep. Let's tuck her in. Dad, dad. Hey, sis, why are you so sad? <sighs> Shapulats are about to attack our world with full power. Of course I'm sad, Mootlu. Oh. Neshi, I found out where Manny is. He's on a Shopalot ship. So did your conversation with the Pink Planet Chief settle anything? Sadly, no, Neshi. The Council Chief can't be persuaded. But we are giving their baby back to them. What else could they want? They want the Earth. They always wanted the Earth since the first day, I think. Neshi, don't worry. The entire Pink Planet is gonna help. We'll do our best to protect the Earth. Well, what about Manny? I have a plan for that. We need to use the mysterious hat. Put the medallion on your neck and let the colors fill the world around you. With the power of the Pink Planet, Sparkle now becomes the word. Are you going to give them Shoppy? I think I have to. Neshi, I think this baby is actually pretty sweet. I think so too. Hold on to me real tight. Are you leaving now, dear? I am, Mom. We don't have much time. Do we have to give her back? She's happy here. Maybe she wants to stay. See you later, Mom. <laughs> Neshi! Goochaloo! At last we found you! Wait, where's Minnie? She'll be here soon. Hello there! See, I told you. Manny! My brother! Are you alright? I'm fine, Minnie! Come on, get me out of here! Step back! I knew you'd come to the rescue! Now it's time for the green crystal! For the green crystal? Of course! Since the Shopalots broke the deal, we can take the green crystal back. Hold on to me, everyone. Just think of the green crystal we gave to the Shopalot Council Chief. <laughs> Here we are. All right, take the green crystal. Wait, Goochloo, oh. there are light rays around it. Uh. Oh. What do we do now? We can't do it. We should just take the green crystal and get out of here. But first, let's get rid of these colored lights. Ah! Oh, we need to get out of this room. I open the door. Let's leave. There are only stars behind that door. Chapelots are everywhere. Oh, this is bad. Hold on to me, everyone. <gasps> we need to hurry up! Goochloo! Uh, uh, huh. well, do you really think it is that easy to move in space? Come on, Goochloo! Hurry up! Uh, ooh, uh, uh. Ah! Oh, uh. Oh, I'm glad we made it to Earth! <laughs> Neshi? Do I see a baby shop a lot in your house? Or am I just seeing things? Ah, you don't know yet. That's Baby Shoppy. It's the newest member of our family. But how did this happen? I don't really know how it happened. But Mom saw the Baby shop a lot outside the window. She felt sorry and took her in. They love the baby so much. I can see that. As part of the deal today, they might demand the baby back and the green crystal. Yes, I know. It might be the only option to give the baby back. Pink Planet ships are ready. All right then, the big fight is on. Yay, our ship is here. Then let's go. 
Mini to the Shop-A-Lot Council Chief. Let's talk about our deal. <laughs> yes, I know. You are mad at Neshi and the world. But Neshi has nothing to do with this. <laughs> Baby Shop-A-Lot is happy. She is part of Neshi's family now. <laughs> we want no trouble. We don't want to fight with you. We have the green crystal. If we can make a deal again, I can give it back to you. <laughs> don't make a rash decision. Think this through. So you're not gonna blame me for all that's happened to us, Minnie? Why would we blame you, though? It is obvious that the baby shop a lot fled and then came to Earth. This isn't your fault. Our ship is being targeted. Do you think it's easy to beat us? Planet Earth is home to our dearest friends. We would never leave them alone. Mini to the shop -a Council Chief. <laughs> our offer still stands. <laughs> All right, then we'll see you back on Earth. What did he say? If we give them back the crystal and the baby, they'll finally leave us alone. Aha, uh -huh. that's great. Open your mouth. <laughs> Mmm, here comes the spaceship. Here comes the spaceship. Mmm, 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 Open your mouth, you cute little baby. I never had such delicious baby food before. That's not right, son. We made this for you, too. I don't know. I've never really seen you caring for somebody else like this before. We cared for both you and your sister just like this. You were so little. Of course you don't remember. <laughs> the shop -a -lot Council Chief has agreed to make a deal again. Uh -huh, that's great news. Hear that, Shoppy? I knew your big sister would figure it out. <laughs> they want us to give Shoppy back. But sis, they'll be here soon, okay? I have to take Shoppy. Attitude. No, I can't do this. I'm sorry. Nashi? This decision should be Shoppy's. She can live with whomever she wants to. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> Make a choice, Shoppy. Do you want to live with the shop -a lots or with us? <laughs> We're ready to sign the deal again, Chief. <laughs> Oh, my dear daughter. I knew you'd figure out a way. So, a hat!